name is Kinga Reka Sekei. I'm a Unitarian minister here in Transylvania. I serve the community in a small village on the big Homorod Valley called Homorod St. Peter. I have been appointed here in 1995 and since then I have been serving here. In 1999-2000 uh, I've been a Balash scholar at Star King in Berkeley, California and uh, when uh, I got uh, back from Berkeley in 2000, then I got married, I have a family, we have uh, four kids. And uh, not uh, very long ago, let me think, I think it was three years ago, I've been uh, elected to be the president uh, for the Minister's Association here in Transylvania. Dakota asked me what uh, was my experience uh, being a Balash scholar in Berkeley at Star King. I told him that I had the best year of my life. Uh, I think, first of all, because I've been in the States before, uh, first uh, time I went in 95, then I went in 97 and 98, and at my second stay I had my uh, cultural shock and I was not uh, angry with the Americans anymore. So when I went uh, to Berkeley in my life for the third time visiting the United States, I could really embrace everything what uh, was called America or what was called UUism in the United States. What I have uh, learned of course, it was that um, there are many viewpoints of life and um, back here in Transylvania, we should uh, leave behind a little bit our uh, traditional way of thinking and our traditional way of living. In other words, we should be more open and um, we should be ready to host many different ideas and many different ways of living. I also gained some kind of optimism at Star King and that optimism tells me that uh, we always have to go out and find people who are like-minded and probably when we can gain or when we can gather a nice support group for ourselves, then uh, it's always easier to go on with our everyday life. Having the chance to meet so many wonderful people, both uh, at seminary and around the country, visiting many different churches, I had the best year of my life. Of course, when I came back in 2000, then I had this, as we say, let's save the world, or at least let's save the region where you live. I had these very high aspirations, huge enthusiasm, um, which in a way, um, it was an obstacle, but on the other hand, uh, it really helped me uh, live my everyday life and uh, do my everyday uh, service to the community, to the church. After that huge enthusiasm we gained at Star King, when we came home, uh, sometimes the time of depression came when we realized that uh, we cannot implement everything we have learned there in the United States. But I think this is the normal way that we as, as uh, scholars we went to study, we had the opportunity to meet a new world, we had the opportunity to learn many wonderful things, but it's not necessary to get or to uh, transport everything from 
California or from the United States back here to Transylvania. If you take a look at the uh, Minister's Association, to me it's very obvious that there is a difference between those ministers who have been Bolash scholars and those who have not. And uh, I'm not uh, thinking it in, in a negative way. I just say that those who have had the Starking experience, um, they can uh, smile longer than those who have never had the chance to go there. And uh, those who had the uh, experience of UUism in the United States, when they came home, they have like more hope and more faith that uh, our movement or our church can be as lively, as joyful as it is the UU movement or the UU church in the United States. Thank you.